Alright guys, today I'm going to be bringing you guys how to get your HD PVR2 to work with OBS, the brand new OBS. It works so good, I fucking love it. I used to have an Elgato, but then I traded that in, or I sold it with my old computer and kept my HD PVR2 just in case, and I actually do enjoy it. Works so well for me. So um, I'm going to start off with, go to your settings right here, go all the way down, find system settings. And uh, disable this enable HDCP, but take that off or else you're going to get the black screen. You're not even going to be able to use your HD PVR and that works with an Elgato too. You got to take it off. So whatever, whatever system you're using. All right. So I'm going to show you guys my best settings though. So after you've done that, you're good. Leave there. All right. Now you go back to your computer. Obviously you guys, if you guys don't have OBS, go to, I'll just open up edge here. Go to Google, type in OBS download right there so look at that obs go to it click it download it boom good to go all right so get out of there after you've done it run it just download whatever it says to download all right so i'm gonna start off with um you know so people say use window capture and stuff like that when you're uh doing hdpvr2 now now, don't even open up your system for HD PVR. You know how like you'd have to open it up and then monitor, capture it, and whatever you had to do. Now you can just go open it up, video capture device, click it. It'll come up. I'll, I'll click OK because I already have it there as existing. But boom, right there. Click it. Run it. Good to go. That's all you got to do. That's what I do. That's what I do on this screen right here. And it works perfectly. All right, so another thing, I'm gonna go a little more into depth here. File, go to file, file settings, all right? So general, I didn't even touch any of that, except you might be like, oh, your theme's different. It's just right here, under theme, right here. Instead of default, I have it dark. Whatever you want, preference. I think there's a pink one in there somewhere. Yeah, you can do that one if you want, but I'm okay. I'm gonna go with dark, little whatever. Okay, stream. Whatever, you can put your stream and stuff. If you don't even stream, then you don't have to worry about it. Output, so streaming, if you do, I put audio track. I put it to number two there. Encoder, right here, X264. Uh, rescale output, I put 1280 by 720. I just record in 720. Uh, CBR, constant bit rate, you got to put your rate control to. Uh, bit rate, 5000. Uh, keyframe intervals, put it to two. And then CPU, I put it to very fast, profile on high, and tune none. I didn't even touch that. Okay. Now, same thing under output, go to recording. Uh, right here, standard, type standard. And then recording, I use an external hard drive, so I throw everything on that. It's like a two terabyte. So I just throw everything on there just so I can have it even if I'm not even at my own personal workstation here. So audio track, or uh, I put uh, recording format MP4 because usually everything uses MP4. Like Vegas Pro, really good with MP4s. Audio track, I use two. Uh, encoder, this is like the NVNCH is your NVIDIA graphics card. So click that if you have NVIDIA, or you can probably use that X264 again. Uh, rescale output, I put 1280 by 720 again. Uh, Again, this is the exact same thing as the last uh, under streaming. Uh, rate control, CBR, constant bit rate, uh, bit rate 5000. Key interframes, uh, interval seconds is a two. Uh, preset default, profile high, uh, level 5.1, and uh, B frames two. And then audio, I didn't even touch that, doesn't matter. Uh, audio, so all my stuff is just set up like this mic is set up to. Um, my computer under default so that I don't even touch any of that so I don't even have to worry about it um so base canvas resolution 1920 by uh 1080 good that's really good but then my output scale resolution is 1280 by 720 so it's just downscaling my video and whatever it does uh common frames per second there I have uh 30 whatever I didn't even touch it Key, uh, the hotkeys are like, so say you want to mute your mic really quick and do whatever you want to do. Uh, you can preset those, but I didn't even preset any. Advanced. Um, the only thing I touched in advanced was uh, stream delay. That's all I do when I stream like search and destroy tournaments or whatever I'm doing. Um, I put enable and I put 45 seconds. Just in case I plant the bomb, me and my boys plant the bomb. And then 
someone stream watching and if i didn't have the delay they can tell where we were and then kill all of us and defuse it so whatever so after you've done that apply it obviously but i didn't do anything so just click in the exit okay so then next you uh want to put a delay on like your mic your webcam and stuff like that so we'll go to uh what is it we'll go to edit and then go to advanced audio properties and then i put uh sync offset right here under mic put a thousand desktop audio put a thousand and desktop audio a thousand means like when you open skype your buddy's skype not when you're talking to them will be a second behind but it's how obs picks it up so when you actually have a conversation um it's not like their voice your voice it's like the actual conversation what's going down and it'll pick it up so yeah that will be perfect and then when you go here um to get the microphone like that i'm using um to get the good quality and stuff uh click this little uh gearbox here go to filters um you want to do click this little arrow thingy right here um you're going to want to put noise gate and suppression so obviously click noise gate and then do it again click the arrow again and click suppression so under suppression let's go uh minus 60 degrees, so decibels whatever that works perfect and noise gate i just leave alone i don't even touch that okay so then now we're back at this so now your mic should be working good but then you're wondering like kale uh why is my webcam not synced so you're gonna want to go here under filters again you're gonna go video delay so under here right here video delay click it and then you're gonna put the video delay to a thousand milliseconds so it's one second otherwise it's not gonna work and whatever so obviously close her up after and that should be it guys everything should be working should be working perfectly fine uh, here's mine I'll go up 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 down 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 works perfect love it and uh, yeah guys if you guys have any questions concerns uh, just tweet me at into detail or just leave a comment down below and please do not leave this video without leaving a like comment or subscribing thanks guys